Hi, this is Allie with Tom Reddit Food Service Solutions. Today we're going to be talking about the request for walk-in quotation form. This form is important to us as it gives us information regarding the walk-in that your customer is interested in. There's just a few fields that need to be filled out and this is a start for us to get the information that's needed. If there's any other questions, we'll give you a call or contact you via email. Uh, we just need to know the person requesting the quote and the company name, the email address, meaning your email address, so that we can send you the email, the project name, which gives us a uh, reference that we can look for in the future if needed for revisions, etc. Project location is important to us as it gives us the location of the walk in so that we can figure the freight and then also if it's going to be an outdoor walk-in this lets us know what the weather um, around the walk-in will be such as snow load etc uh, we have coolers freezers and combos our standard temperature these are for holding only is at 35 degrees for a cooler our freezer standard temperature is negative 10 degrees, although we do offer a zero degree temperature freezer as well. That would just need to be indicated right here. And a combo, and these can be multiple configurations such as a cooler freezer, a cooler cooler, it can be a three compartment or a four compartment or even more. We would just need to know the dimensions for each compartment as well as an overall dimension of the entire walk-in. We would need to know the total length, width, and height, and also ask that, a provide, that you provide a sketch or a drawing, if available. Um, even if it's a hand-drawn sketch, it provides us the information to get a visual to see the layout of the walk-in and where the doors may be located. Um, our standard dimensions is what we'll, what we'll no, normally quote unless it's indicated that it needs to be an exact dimension, such as eight foot zero by eight foot zero. If it's a standard dimension walk-in, an eight foot by eight foot would be an actual seven foot nine by seven foot nine. And we can go over that information with you as well at the time of the quote request. Our standard heights with floors are seven foot six and eight foot six. Without floors, they're seven foot two and eight foot two. On freezers, it's 99.9% .9 of the time we will include a floor in the freezer. There are special exceptions, but that discussion would need to be had with either your master belt representative or myself when the quote request is being asked for. We would need to know if the walk-in is going to be for indoor application or outdoor application. If it's for indoor, if it's going on a second level, or if there's a basement underneath the walk-in, we will need to make sure that we include a floor as temperature rises and that can cause problems with the humidity and such from the underneath side of the walk-in. If it's for outdoor application, this is important also so that we know, again, the weather surrounding your walk-in so that we can figure the correct roof that's needed. If it's an outdoor application, we would need to know if it is freestanding out by itself or if it's flashed up against an existing building. If it's flashed, we would need to know what side of the walk-in is flashed up against the existing building. For instance, if the walk-in is an eight foot by 10 foot, we would just need to know, is it the eight foot wall or the 10 foot wall that's flashed? Our standard finishes are 26 gauge acrylic stucco galvanized. We do offer other finishes. We would just need to know at the time of the quote if a different finish is required. Um, as I spoke about earlier, floors and the cooler, those are optional unless it is on an upper level. Um, freezer floors are mostly quoted. 
Our standard size door is 36 by 78. We do have other sizes available. We would just need that indicated here if a different size is required. The door swing, is it left hinge or right hinge? If glass doors or sliding doors are needed, we would need to know that regarding, uh, we would need to know the sizes and the quantities that are required. We have different types of refriger refrigeration. We have a top mount self-contained, and we also have a pre-assembled air-cooled remote and water-cooled, uh, available in single phase or three phase. Not all top mount self-contained systems are available in three phase, so that would need to be determined at the time of the quote. We have multiple accessories listed here, are just a few of them. We have floor ramps, either interior or exterior. We do ask that if a ramp is needed to please advise if your customer will be rolling carts, dollies, or pallet jacks. Uh, this will let us know how we need to quote the floor. If there are rolling items in and out, we'll need to reinforce the floor accordingly. We have extra lights available. Uh, we have the globe type. We have four foot lights available in fluorescent or LED. We have peep windows, also known as viewport windows. They are 14 inches wide and either 24 inches tall or 14 inches tall. Just need to indicate which size is needed. We have kick plates. In most cases, when kick plates are required, we quote them both in and out of the walk-in door, interior and exterior of the walk-in door. Uh, normally we quote 1 8 inch by 36 inch high diamond tread plate aluminum. And we also have many other accessories that are available. We would just need to know if anything other than what's not listed above here is needed. Just let us know. Hope this quotation form helps. Please feel free to give us a call or an email. And thank you and have a great day.